Sorry, guys. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the spotlight where we showcase our very own Mimi community. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, sorry, we got things going on today all over the place. I'm so sorry. But we're here. We're ready to go. Ready to start the show. I'm super excited. All my people keep commenting uh, earlier over there. Quick, I know. I, sometimes, you know what? We get graded on punctuality. And sometimes I feel like I'm going to get ding for that because I jump from one to the next. But uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Let's all take a quick moment to congratulate Miss Anna Banana on her birthday. So let's all sing to her real quick. Ready? One. Put the cake. Is there a cake emoji? There is a cake emoji. So make sure you guys spam the, the comments of the cake. Ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear banana. Happy birthday to you. Anyways, did you unplug it? Guys, I'm so sorry to do this. Leave me alone. Don't talk to me. Gosh, just turn off the light. Turn off the light. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry about this, but people driving me nuts on this side. You know what I mean? I know. Sheesh. Really? Uh, I was dealing with my baby niece earlier. I was, I couldn't. I just couldn't. I couldn't. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we're ready. We're game. And come on, dude. Come on. No mames. No mames. No mames. Let's get started. <laughs> Yo, what's up, everybody? Thank you so much for joining me this week on The Spotlight, where we bring to you past, present, future artists, and showcase, yes, our very own Meet Me Community. Make sure you hit that pay button at the top and tune in every week, same time, same place. Yeah, let's do this! Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new here, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I see a lot of familiar faces. I'm super excited. And if you will be performing tonight, please request the box now because this, witty, what's up? This is where we start the show today. So we got a show lined up for you guys, an amazing lineup, if I may add. Three, you know what? I'm really excited about all three of them, but one in particular is bringing over a brand new like twist to this. We have yet to hear it on the app. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm really excited. If you're participating today, make sure you request the spotlight. What's up, Mr. Idol? Make sure you you type, you spam your, your uh, show on here too. Let's all wish Miss Banana a happy birthday. But starting with this one right here, you know how we go. We talk about their inspiration artists, a couple of their accolades. You guess who they are, and then we bring them on the camera, and we talk about really everything and anything on here just because they are musicians, singers, amazing performers. So let's give it up to all these wonderful individuals. Here's her inspiration artist. She was a UK's flagship flagship vocalist during the 2000s. While the British press and the tabloids seem to focus on her rowdy behavior, um, fans just were, they, they literally like soaked in who she was from the very beginning. From, an, um, man, what songs does she sing? She sung a lot of songs. Oh, man, should I give it away already? No. She was in movies. People would go see the movies just because she was performing in it. Can you get this? The movie was not the best. And if you guys have seen it, you can agree. It wasn't the best. But everyone went to the movies just to see her perform. Her shows were all sold out until her tragic ending with an overdose made an amazing, ooh, she made an amazing, amazing uh, stamp on, on music culture with Valerie, with Rehab. Ladies and gentlemen, you guessed it, Amy Winehouse. However, have you heard of Miss Oxford Gale? 
Miss Oxford gal, request that spotlight. <laughs> How you doing, my friend? Let me get you the larger box. There we go. How you doing? I'm good. Still feeling a bit like a mermaid right now. <laughs> I, you know what? I, I, you heard me talk about you earlier, and I'm gonna be very. I'm gonna take this opportunity to really give you your criticism. Ready? Go on, go on. Give me the real stuff. Wow, wow. I was literally singing along to it. Every single word, the props, everything was super cool. It was. I don't ever say this word, but I will dare to say it today. It was very cute, very innocent, very like, you know what I mean? It was it was something different. Now, I'm going to talk about Amy Winehouse real quick, but no, let, let's let's go rush right into it. Why is Amy Winehouse an inspiration to you? OK, there's loads of different reasons. Um, if we talk musically and um, the jazz influence that she comes from, I feel like the best artists that stick around, that people remember, are the ones that move away from the trends. So if you look at Adele, if you look at Amy Winehouse, you look at any of the ones that stick, right? They're not the ones who are sticking to the formula. So, it, and it's the lyricism, I think. And I yeah. think it's going back to that old school, it's kind of a postmodern kind of feeling with her, right? There's like kind of a, like a nostalgia when like everyone loves her and there's a reason for it and then secondly like she turns she died when she was 27 because of addiction reasons i turned 27 like next month and i've dealt with addiction kind of addictive personality kind of stuff so i kind of identify with her as well and it's it makes me sad and um, that her life ended then and i feel like my musical life is just beginning how cool. So it's I'm sorry. Like How weird. cool that your musical life is just beginning, not that you're going through the stuff. Um, I asked you to get straight into Amy Winehouse because I wanted people to hear your accent. Does anybody else guess? Can guess where she's from? My accent's a bit weird. Sometimes it doesn't sound like what it should. <laughs> where are you from? Um, I'm from Oxford in the UK. It's like 4 a.m. here. Um, I did go to bed at 6 p.m. and woke up at 11.30 to become a mermaid. I love it. I love it. I love it. So uh, if you guys don't know, Oxford Gal was actually in the show that is on also, right? It's still going, right? Yeah. On at Over at Hoops' show, Search for the Stars. But today we have her on the spotlight. So she was doing a couple of things. Number one, thank you so much for, for staying up for us. I think you're the first person from the UK that actually wakes up and uh, does the show. So it's really cool to see people from the opposite side of the world, from me, be on here and coming on the show and getting that attention that normally wouldn't necessarily get it. So with that being said, do you have anything prepared to us by Amy Winehouse? Yeah, I have, a, I have like two or three, whatever, however many like. So I've got a couple songs that I always sing. Um, so I thought I'd just go for those. We can do your favorite song by Amy Winehouse. How about that? Yeah, let's do that one. Okay. okay. Wait, wait. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the spotlight where we showcase our very Omimi community. In the box, you're about to hear some amazing talent. So whenever you're <laughs> ready, take it away. All right, we've got the karaoke beginning. This says, you know I'm no good by Amy Winehouse.
Congratulations. You got a great voice. I said this the first time I heard you um sing. I'm gonna say it again. And and it's not to be is is more like an observation. The way that you perform is not very common. You have like these um this diction that is very unique, and I I like it a lot, to be honest. I really like it. And it's when when you have this change in in vocal tone that kind of creates that like suspense in people that gets people's heads to turn. So congratulations. Yeah, I, I like it. musical theater training. <laughs> what was that? I was trained in musical theater for 10 years. Yeah, I can see that you're like, you're performing in like you're, you know, yes, I see that. Congratulations. It is really, really awesome. Where else can we find you other than on Mimi Streets? Well, yeah, like I've only started streaming. It's, it's actually my two month anniversary this week. I, I only started doing this because um, I broke my foot two months ago and I couldn't go to work. Uh, <laughs> um, and here we are. But um, I, you can't see me. I'm, tr I'm trying to start a TikTok. So just if you follow, like if you favorite me, I'm going to post a link there. Everyone's saying I need a YouTube. I'm trying to create all the content, but I actually work as a session vocalist and function singer right now. So it's all live that I do, not online. And I'm actually going back to uni to be a lecturer. So I don't know really what I'm going to be doing, but. <laughs> How cool. You know, that's one of the things that I was just going to ask you. Where are you on TikTok, on Instagram, or on YouTube specifically? What about any of your original music? Do you have any original music? So like, this is all really recent. I was originally meant to go into musical theater and then I decided to do a degree and become a teacher and all that stuff. So it's kind of new. Um, I've got a TikTok, it's in my, um, in my description. I've got an Instagram, it's in my description. It's all very new. Um, I'm hoping to put more TikTok videos on. And yeah, like it's, it's all new to me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is super cool. I'm excited for you. Would you, do you have any other songs that you'd like to perform for us? What, not Amy Winehouse? Whatever you want at this point. The first one was to introduce yourself. The second song is about you, who you are. Really, I wanna, I wanna know who Oxford Gal is. So whatever song identifies you uh, with the people, I think that's the most appropriate song now. Okay, um, so I can give you a choice, Angel. <laughs> um, oh, you sing, whatever you want. Okay, okay. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the spotlight. If you're new here, welcome. We showcase Meet Me's best talent across the app. And in the box right now, we've got Oxford Girl singing her own renditions of these. Actually, she just sang Amy Winehouse. If you missed it, shame on you. Favorite me so you can you don't miss out on any other any other self. But up next we got a great lineup too. So don't for, don't miss out on their performances either. What's up, everybody? Welcome. So if you're ready, my friend. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say this. I'm not a lonely person. <laughs> That's what the song kind of says. But it's a song that I recently learned that um, I just love. I love it so much. 
Yeah. Just waiting for the advert. Sorry, Callum Scott. Sorry, I want a side hand. Sorry. Congratulations, you have a beautiful tone, beautiful voice. Let me ask you this. When did you start singing? 
I think like when I was like 10 years old, I wanted to join like the primary school, uh, like choir. I was very, very shy because I was born in India. So English no. is a language. Wait, you speak Indian? I was born in India. I'm, I'm, I, this is my second language. English. Yeah. And then I became an English teacher in England. It's weird. Uh <laughs> you did? How? Guys, uh, how awesome is that? How awesome. So I was very shy at school, but I loved singing. Um, so I was very quiet. Um, but then I started secretly going to drama school on the weekends. Um, and then in school, my grades would be 100% for performances. Um, and that's where I learned confidence and music and then I got the lead in a musical and then it just kind of snowballed yeah. and then I went to a performing arts school um, and then I, I my parents who are doctors said no you must get a degree so I stopped <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny hey Oxford girl I have a question for you what's that is your birthday August 2nd it is all the Americans are like why have you put it in now and I'm like dude like date i'm sorry but you cannot share that birthday with me <gasps> no high five my birthday oh, is on your second too we're like legit birthday twins so yeah? really is i just saw it too <laughs> how cool how cool i man i guess i gotta start putting my birthday up too huh mm. no don't bring your birthday no one will come for mine <laughs> oh okay you can keep yours then but my friend, thank you so much for joining us today. Anything else you'd like to add before I let you go? Uh, just that I'm completely new, guys. I've only been here two months. I'm about to hit 200K. We're trying to make this like, you know, I want to keep doing it while I'm studying and stuff. So any support is really appreciated. Wow. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you hit her with the fave. Make sure you go follow her Instagram, her TikToks, and potentially her new YouTube channel as she exits the box my goodness Thank you all next year. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome man guys i'm telling you this the the meet me streets and the all these streaming platforms they're full of amazing talent full of great people great vibes genuine friendships genuine relationships and guess what genuine artists Yes, you heard it. You heard it. Genuine artist. Up next, all the way. Oh, wait, no, no. I can't, I can't call him out like that. I gotta talk about who his inspiration artist is. So without being said with that, oh, thank you for the bubble gum. Thank you by the for the gifts, by the way. Thank you for the gifts. If I don't acknowledge them, I'm so sorry. It's not that I don't see them. It's just that when my performers are on, I think it's their attention at that moment you know but next to the box we got let me see yes he's there again you guys try guessing who their inspiration artist is as soon as you guess it we bring them on the stage we give them the spotlight yes you know how it is here it goes you ready battle rhymes and mixtape made this artist a major figure from the are on the philadelphia streets before the rapper went underground with a great role on Maybach Music Group, um, Self Made Volume One. No, he contributed to mixtapes. Um, hold on, I'm sorry, <laughs> Amid can oh, continued uh, putting out mixtapes, um, with his solo rapper and proper debut dreams and nightmares anybody guess anybody guess yeah ladies and gentlemen you've heard of meek mill but have you heard of frankie oops what the heck frankie request that spotlight salute oh, salute God. salute good to see you boss salute you to doing? everybody I'm blessed. Thank God for life. That's Good to see up. you, brother. Well, welcome to the spotlight, man. I'm really excited to have you. I've heard really good things about you. Would you go ahead and introduce yourself? Uh, well, I'm Frankie Da Vinci, and um, I'm a streamer on here as well. Well, I, I'm a lyricist as well because I try to play with music and just generate it in my phone. 
you know, just bring something out, out of it and just stay optimistic with it and super guaranteed 100% because uh, I love to bring the vibe. Hey, that's a great way to introduce yourself. I like to bring the vibe. The vibes aren't here. I bring them with me. That's the stuff. I'm excited. Let me ask you, why is he an inspiration artist to you, Chris? Um, well, being a lyricist actually just made me kind of like go out there on the street and just try to see what um, music is all about. And as well, um, I'm naturally from the state, so I actually just love this dude. Like a word he actually said, he said he made a, over a hundred mixtapes before he got an album. So I, I've been like generating my mind on that. I'm like, okay, I believe if he did it, I could actually do it as well. You know, they say it takes about maybe 10 years before an artist makes it big. And his consistency, yeah. his perseverance, it is just genuinely hashing it out. You know what I mean? If it were an easy career, I think that everyone would would take up this artistry. And you know what? It's not an easy, it's not easy. Trust me, it's not easy. So props to you. I'm excited to hear something that you got going on. Before I continue, you said you were a lyricist. How long have you been writing? I barely write what I generated from my brain. It all comes in from that. It's I use my live experience to try to put it in the beats. That's super awesome. Way cool. Well, if you're ready, do you have anything ready by um, our our dear friend, um, Mr. Uh, Meek? Okay. Uh, I can actually go for words to words, but would you rather just prefer me to like lip sing it a little bit than i could do me because i rather do me my own self like i kind of make my own words to words and make it better um sure go ahead so you want me to lip sing that right i want you to perform it <laughs> so whatever you got okay all right all right one minute, let me get the instrumental. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the spotlight where we showcase our very own Meet Me community. We've got a blast. We've got a great lineup today. If you're new here, make sure you hit the fave. Make sure you tune in every week, same time, same place. If you know of any artists, anybody that knows how to perform, send them my way. I'd be happy to host them and get them on the show. These guys are amazing. Week after week performers from all over the world tune in just to showcase their talent down here so mr frankie whenever you're ready my boy all right i'm ready just a quick Wait. one that i uh, do me <sighs> is this all what they'll be waiting for okay I wake up every morning walking on the street, you know my vibes. I got my dreams, let me try to chase it every night. It doesn't matter where we coming from, you know the vibe. I'm coming with the swag, can't we try to appreciate it? Dreams a night, man, let me try to be the dream chasers. I keep it real, let me try to appreciate my state. I gotta be the man, let me try to make it right. My mama used to tell me when we gather, we appreciate it. It was all on the dream, you know I keep them rims. I gotta keep it, let me try to appreciate it. It now and when the people try to see me with my tribe they know we rising to the top never give up to my fight i never want to try to be the back away you know i'm coming strong can they try to appreciate it i'm coming from the feeling state of mind and that's a perfect swag they gotta see me rising let them know we grinding harder okay you know haters can relate when we be the great i got the faith let me try to celebrate i got the taste of faith let them know we never late i'm gonna be the knight let me try to be a vibe okay everybody gotta see when we bought the Aston Martin related to my real democratic faith I gotta be the team and that's a rhythm to it I know I write it down let them know we ain't to it we ain't done you know we're getting gone we gotta keep it when we try to glow every time they gotta see us rather never give up to your pride and take up on your drive can we try to appreciate my heart it doesn't matter where you're coming from you gotta keep it keep it going and try to 
be the rhythm of time to it and try to appreciate your fight to your highest life and that's the smiles in your face every day and night sorry i keep forgetting to turn off the 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 mute ladies and gentlemen let's give it up for frankie yo i have a question for you have you ever do you come up with lyrics like on the spot mm, yeah i do yeah? So is it just, that being a lyricist is different than being a rapper, correct? Um, yeah, being a lyric, uh, being a lyricist is different from a rapper, yeah, because um, rappers stick to their manuscript and their written words, but being a lyricist, you can just generate words from your brain and just get it out there and just keep it one hundred as long as you have clean words and everything just comes out smooth. How cool! What inspires you to do this? life the image of today what today has in stock for us what we face out there you know what tomorrow has to be better just keep my hope and my faith heavier than my weight that no matter what it is just never give up keep doing what you can do best you know what you 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 may have just kind of been just not even rehearsed what you just said now, but that was very beautiful. Congratulations. I agree. I agree with you 120%. You know, where are you from? I'm actually a mixed race. My mom is West African, Nigerian. My dad is from France, but I was born in Nigeria, actually. Wh where, currently in Qatar. Without getting too specific, where do you live now? I live in Qatar, in the Middle East currently wow guys this stream has been phenomenal can you listen from the uk oh what time is it out there right now 6 35 a.m in the morning frankie thank you so much for waking up for this i appreciate you ladies and gentlemen make sure you hit him with the babe this waking up this time to sing to do this takes a lot i'm just saying they asked me to do that one time and i said never again so <clears throat> frankie you you said you're a lyricist do you have any of your own lyrics that you'd like to share with us oh sure we would really like that but before sure. we continue with that are you on any other platform like um instagram yeah 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 um, let me find you yeah instagram frankie da vinci on here frankie on the tag street frankie on um, um youtube frankie da vinci as well i'm just trying to process my progression and just getting better you know keep get just doing it and go out there and let the world try to appreciate you how cool congratulations man ladies and listen as artists we live off of those numbers so go subscribe to his youtube channel Go follow him on Instagram. Go like, comment, and retweet on every single one of his posts. You know what I mean? Guys, if you are a content creator, my Brody, go ahead and drop, please, your uh, your show on here as well. He's got an awesome show as well. So, Frankie, if you're ready. Yeah. Let's, let's go. go. Okay. One second, please. All right. This like some real talk in real life. I wake up through the negativities, I know the fight Through the struggles and muscles, let me try to get my right I go on my knees, I'm really ready for my prayers Getting ready, suited up, you know I'm out the street And that's the rhythm, let me try to be a man I grab a cup of tea, check it out, you see the stuff up really hard And that's the vibe, let me try to get it back With the negativities, people crying with the poverty Damn, and what is going on? I'm thinking tired.
high above the pains. I wake up, let me try to get it when we never drain. I see the rain when we try to change the fate. We never live, you know, we come and let me celebrate. I never give up on my hope, you know, we truly shining. I gotta tell myself, I beat my chest to my vibe. I tell my mama, some days, you know, I make you proud. I'm getting better, getting better. We stand and tell to it. I see my mama smiles as a blessing in my heart. My father gone so soon. I told him on his grave and yeah, I'm gonna make you smile. Try to be the figure. I'm gonna hustle till my toes bleed to the regal. I'm looking real. Okay, they try to talk about me. The world got a story with the negativities. I tell them, let me try to be the storyteller. Let me try to get it. My heavenly father is the finish. I get in real and that's the perfect deal. You know we on the game. I got Gotta keep it strict, it doesn't matter where we're from. They said he got an accent, I know I'm super decent. You gotta check my frequencies, you know I'm super recent. And that's the time when you know you understand it. And never give up on your fight, you try to get it right. And let them know, let them take the next flight day and night. They see you elevated to the top with them cries. Okay, through the pains, that's the rhythm for your fight. I tell my mama, let them know. Know I'm gonna make her proud. I'm rising every day. You know I think I'm looking great. And shout out for this opportunity. You know the heart. I take it back. Let me try to track my road where I'm coming from. When we have to fly over, you know we on. I never give up through the struggles, through my muscles. The days are getting harder. That's your rhythm. When you get it right, be yourself. I never give up opportunities. You only live it once. And that's your rhythm to the tear. I'll never try to hate it, brother On the struggle to the muscle I am the black brother with the golden white heart Take a pen and paper, you know we're standing together United we are, divided we fall You know that's truth, I'm real talk Let me try to be the hit And try to bring the vibe When we try to take it back Celebrate, you know we deliberate When you're super calculated I try to figure it Let them know I'm dedicated I know what I'm doing, you know, I think I got my symbolists. When you serve your love with them, you know the vibe. I'm so tied to it. I tell my mama, I'm really gonna make her smile. I see the pains in her face day and night. I tell my mama, I'm gonna make her proud. Keep pushing. Keep pushing, adjust to your pain, never give up on your fight. I keep pushing, I keep pushing, I never give up on your fight every day and night. Let's go! Let's give him a round of applause, please. This man, oh my goodness. I'm going to ask you something. What is your native language? Um, actually, that side we speak French, mom side we speak African, Igbo, you know. Are you able, look at, I'm getting messages. He has to be the best rapper you've had on your show. Like, how cool is that, you know? Are you able to, to do a little freestyle in a different language? Yeah, I could, I could do something. All I just need is, um... Like I could go versatile in different types of um, languages. All I like, I did something called "Thank You," so I just needed to grab the word in Arabic, in English, and French, and in kind of Spanish, and just put it all together. It's just if you have the right to create it right, you do it tight. Yeah, if you if you don't mind sharing that with us, that'd be really cool. All right. Okay. Let's go! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the spotlight. Today's stream is popping amazing singers. Don't move, stay tuned, because after Mr. Frankie, we got another phenomenal artist as well. If you're new here, welcome. Make sure you hit me with the fave. Thank you for the gifts, everybody. Y'all are amazing. I appreciate you so much. I see each and every one of you. So Mr. Frankie's about to do a little freestyle with like probably four different languages. Make sure you show him some love. Make sure you go hit him with the favorite. Make sure you check out his streams. Make sure you subscribe to his YouTube, to his Instagram, Facebook, everything. So, Mr. Frank, you ready? Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let, 
this adds. One second, and we are. Wait. Okay. I think it's time for languages. Like, how do I say hello? The Philippines would be like. I'm gonna take you around the world. Wait, Philippines gotta tell you, Kamusa, you get it right. I'm telling you, thank you. They gotta tell you, Salamat. I'm going to the French with my broken other ways. Francophones, they gotta tell you, Marcella Bell. And that's the Dell. Can you try to really ring the bell? I'm leaving in the Middle East. I'm bringing every rhyme. I rock the people, gonna tell you, Shukuria. And that's the deal when we gotta keep it in we're making real okay thank you k do i'm going to my tribe my mama from the eastern africa they gotta tell you hello candy way what is going on which way and that's a slave when we try to really make it great designated you know my people when we get it right they want to tell you shukra and that's a k for holly how you doing you gotta let them know we feeling blessed I got the test, it doesn't matter, let me get the best Okay, they tell you Kuya, you know they say poo And that's the rule, when they look you, when you know the two I try to tell you languages, but we we'll never try to defy you Let them know we stand and talk, we're the greatest They gotta say A, hey, and that's the better way My Spanish people say hola hola, camusta, come on and slap You gotta say bien, okay I'm doing great, you say Zane, and that's the way when you get it great. Shout out to people from the cultures in the world. It doesn't matter where you coming from, we getting started. Be your brother's keeper, you know the flag and culture never differ. You gotta learn it with the languages, you know we on. I'm taking you back, Nigeria got the different languages. They got the Igbo, Yoruba with them, how it says. They gotta tell you, K do. That when you gotta say Adima and let me try to break it back. I think I love my mother and shout out to our rugby people. That's the time to it. They gotta say Zane. And when you say Mafi Shogo, you know we never local to my Vida Loco. I wanna take you to the world when you appreciate it. Damn. My Indian people. Mm. Take it back, like, they tell you Shukaria. Mm. Shukaria, I'm gonna say Salamat and Merci Bien. You know, we're doing great. I'm gonna tell you, Zane, we try to appreciate. I'm going everywhere in my brain. You know, I'm steady. Hey, keep it real, that's the path of deal. Yo, let's give it up for Frankie! Let's go! Frankie, thank you so much for number one, staying up with me all night. Number two, for performing. And number three, for being such an amazing individual. Please make sure, guys, you favorite Frankie as he exits the box. Before I let you go, anything else you'd like to add? uh if you look at my emojis it says it shows you a different color it means a lot we need units to stand together keep doing it and keep it right don't forget be your brother's keeper and just keep it 100. much love to you all. i love that thank you frankie thank you so much appreciate you thank you for stopping by ladies and gentlemen welcome to the spotlight guys if you're new here welcome you're welcome any anytime you want to come by. Make sure before you exit, you hit me with the fave right up here somewhere. Right there. Right there. It's right there. Hey, thank you for the refave, my friend. Thank you for the refave. I appreciate everyone refaving me. Um, other than that, ladies and gentlemen, we've got an amazing show lined up. This last performer is not last because he's last. He's got an amazing talent on top of what he does let me tell you wait 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 wait. I'm, I'm already getting ahead of myself thank you so much for the gift ladies and gentlemen 
Let's go. This next artist is best is inspiration artist is best known as the leader, the founder, the songwriter, singer, the guitarist of the early to eight uh 1980s funk master. He went by a different name. I'm gonna say it. He went by Zap. But his real name was another one, which I'm trying to get you guys to guess what it is. Also an amazing, successful career. Born in November of nine, uh, 1951 and uh, was the fourth child in his family of nine kids and who gravitated naturally to music Can you, at such an early age. Um, he, he, he usually was playing the lead uh, parts in in local bands, including uh, an outfit called the Crusaders. At the age of eleven, he also was a a also in a band later discovered by his brother. He was playing the drums. Um, he grew up broke in the early sixties, but this artist stuck together and became such an influence in the R and B legends like BB King. Jimmy Reed, Chuck Jason, and in addition to such a a top charting sensation like The Temptations and even The Beatles in the late 60s, he added an organ to his resume as far as instrumentation. So ladies and gentlemen, Jesus, I should know this. I know. Nobody's guessed this. Ladies and gentlemen, Roger Troutman. If you've heard of him, you've had, you've heard, you have, if you've heard of him, have you heard of Mr. I don't know how to say that name. Vocal, vocal, vocoder, vocoder, vocoder. Thank you guys. What's up? <laughs> I'm sorry. What, what is it? Vocoder? Yeah. Vocoder. Vocoder. Oh, vocoder. Yeah. Let me ask you why vocoder? Vo vocoder. Okay. Um, vocoder basically it's, a kind of um, sound that you hear Daft Punk use, and it's it's always on a keyboard. Um, let's see Yamaha motif keyboards or montage. You're getting it. So it has this robotic sound. It's actually spelled V O C O D E R. That's the way it's spelled. So, but I I was trying. So I coined my name from it. I coined my brand name from it. So I changed the C to K. So instead of it being spelled V O C O D E R, I changed it to V O K O D E R. So for those of you who don't know, he's about to play an instrument that is almost extinct, an instrument that has re that revolutionized the funk music, an instrument I wish I knew how to play, <laughs> that I wish I had. Ladies and gentlemen, help me get help me get this instrument. But my boy is about to play something that Bruno Mars actually brought back. Am I correct? Yeah, in Twenty Four Karat Magic. Brought it back in his late um in one of his songs, Twenty Four Karat Magic. Twenty Four. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen it and I've heard it play in person. And let me tell you, it is amazing. Is this this like piano thing that is connected to that tube that he has on there? <laughs> now, you know what? I'm just gonna, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm getting too excited because this is definitely one of my favorite instruments. I wish I could play it, but go ahead and introduce yourself, man. Okay. Um, basically, I'm the vocoder and I'm a talk box artist. This instrument is called a talk box, like T A L K B O X, talk box. So, and um, basically, I'm the only talk box artist presently in Africa for now. And of course, you need talk about artists and, and meet me. <laughs> Literally. So you're from Africa, right? You're from Africa, right? Yeah, I'm from Africa, yeah. What time is it for you right now? It's 4.52 a.m. Guys, <laughs> guys, you guys are the real people here. <laughs> Thank you so much for speaking. For real, man. We had 6 a.m. We had 4 a.m. We have another 4 a.m. Wow. Thank you for the dedication. I appreciate you. So You're welcome. <laughs> if you're ready, I want to get right into it. 
if you're ready, would you please okay. play something that um, Roger made famous for us? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to do one of Roger's. In fact, it should be Roger's most famous song. It's called Computer Love. So uh, I'm, I'm going to do that now. Let's go. Okay. Yeah. So let's do this.
Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Man, hey, you know what? There's something I got to say. I had the uh, out here, mm, maybe about an, two hours away from me, uh, lives MC Magic. You know who MC Magic is? Yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness. I've had the privilege I have the privilege of meeting him in person and talking wow. to him. We've done a couple of red carpets together and you know what? Really? Wow. Yeah. He's an Whoa. amazing artist, <laughs> a great person. And every time I he sees me, he goes, Angel, I wish I had my talk box because I <laughs> always hype him up. I always hype him up. His his uh whole setup is awesome. <laughs> He does lives on Facebook and Instagram, and he's actually playing things, you know? Amazing yeah. guy. Amazing, amazing <laughs> individual. I, I follow him on Instagram, so I get his updates regularly. Yeah. He's a great guy. I, I, I want to say one of the few artists that still play the voice box. Yeah. So I, I'm excited. This is awesome. Do you have any of your own music? Yeah, I do. I have one, just one. I'm still working on my album, my debut album. So I just have one. Um, it's uh, The link is on my Instagram bio. And it's gospel, though. I do gospel outside the app. <laughs> no, we're like, a voice box with the gospel? Yeah, yeah, I do gospel. I'm a gospel artist outside the app. Hey, <laughs> but awesome. on the app, I do all kind of music. <laughs> that's super cool. Where else can we find you other than on the movie streets? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, you can get me on on YouTube, the Vocoda, on Instagram, the underscore Vocoda, on Twitter, on TikTok. I'm not that active on TikTok because I, I um we ha we have an American artist called Mr. Talkbacks who who is um good who was who is uh, well known on TikTok. So that's why I couldn't be active more on TikTok because I don't want to be like a rival to to him. He he was the one that did the intro to the twenty four card magic song by Bruno Mars. His name is called Mister Talkbox. Yeah. yeah, he's an American guy. He's in Nashville, so he's so big on TikTok. So I just don't want to go telling to him. So that's why I didn't just. I'm not just. I'm on TikTok, but I'm not just active like streaming or maybe yeah. But on tagged on Meet Me, definitely. <laughs> yeah. Did you say he's from Nashville? Yeah, he, he's from um. Um, there's a part of America he's from, but he's currently staying on Nashville. I'm gonna go find him now, Mr. Talkbox, right? Yeah, just type it on 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 um Instagram. Just type Mr. Talkbox, he's gonna pop up. He I'm is it? He won. He won. You know the you know the 24 card magic song won two Grammy awards, so he had one of his it, the award got to him too. <laughs> it was a big awesome. song, though. Super yeah. Cool. Well, man, before I let you go, would you please perform your original song for us? Uh, really, I can't really do that now because it, I don't have the beat here. I don't have the beat. <laughs> it's still with my producer, so I don't have it yet. Well, you can listen to it, though, if you can go on stream. Get my, just help me, support me by streaming, you know, by any shit. <laughs> I know. I was super excited to hear it, too. Uh, oh, I, 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 because of that, maybe I'm gonna go get. I'm gonna get. I ask my producer to get me the beat. Just, I just, I just, I just need to get an empty beat where I can free each both put talk box and both vocals all together. Yeah. Um, I do. By the way, whoever texts me, and yes. Um, so would you be able to perform any other song for us? Yeah, of course, of course. Why not? Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the spotlight where we showcase our very own Meet Me community. <laughs> If you're new here, sit down, pull up some popcorn and a nice drink, and watch this as we showcase our very own talent from here on the app. So if you're...
out wow almost ready yeah hey, no worries okay i'm ready so, let's so i'm not doing another song by um by roger trotman it's a popular song you may know it so um enjoy gotta meet yourself right <laughs> oh yes California, close up for it. California, close up for it. In the city of LA, in the city of Blue Watch. City of Captain, keep it rocking, keep it rocking. Let's shake it, come on. Come on, shake it, shake it, shake it, baby. Shake it, shake it. Shake it, shake it, mama. Shake it, Kali. Shake it, Winty, shake it, Winty, shake it, shake it, shake it, Winty, 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 Shake 
Thank you, guys. <laughs> Man, that was awesome. Just <laughs> you to request a box before my uh, feature is is off, so I, we can talk about your show too. But man, I genuinely appreciate your musicianship, your skills. It, I was literally like rocking out over here. I was getting messages on the side. People loving your music. Thank we you so much. Hear your original music. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you don't have them, fade. Make sure you <laughs> make sure you check out his stream. Unfortunately, I think he's gonna be like like on the opposite time zones as us. But make sure you stay up. And make sure you go show them some love before yeah. I let you go. Anything else you'd like to add? Okay. Um, well, I just want to say, I just want to thank you um, for um, the opportunity to come up. I'm actually new on the app. And I want to, I just want to be on as, as much as platforms I can get to from up to see my talent and see what I can do. And this means a lot to me. Well, let me come up on your platform and I'm very grateful. God bless you. <laughs> No, man. You know what? The reason why we have this show is to showcase amazing talent like yourself. So feel free to box up whenever you see me live. I know it's going to be hard because of the time difference, but feel free to use my, my platform to give yourself some exposure. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure you hit him with the fave. Thank you so much, buddy, for stopping by. I appreciate you. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Take care. Take care. Julie, if you're still on here, yes. Mix, can you box up real quick? Talk about your show. I like to do it when other content creators come on. Oh, here she is. Damn. Not Jilly's first time in my box. Let's go. This is the first time. <laughs> I love, look, she looks stunning. Look at her. Oh, thank you. You caught me. I was up late hanging out for a little bit. So I came I in know. here. So for those of you who don't know, this is, is Jilly baby. Would you talk about your show a little bit before uh, we have the featured ending? Yes, yeah, so um, my show is every Tuesday. Me and Angel share uh, Tuesday, one of the best content days, period. Wow. Um, but uh, my show is called Entanglements, and we do this every Tuesday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, it's a little fun. You know, uh, Chris uh, Chris Casper calls it the Mari of the app, the Mari show of the app. <laughs> People come on and they share their real life entanglement stories. So think of a uh, complicated relationship or situationship, usually involving at least three people, a lot of times more than, uh, and they come on, you have, if you have, listen, if you have an entanglement, please slide into my uh, DMs on Instagram. It's Jilly baby. Thank you, JJ. Um, and let me know. I'd love to have you come on the show. Um, my guests come on. Uh, so if you come to the show, I will usually give a recap. I will retell the entanglement from the previous show. And then we'll get an all fresh new entanglement. I take notes. We have fun. Um, this is what, uh, these are entanglements. Uh, I just put them on the wall next to me, but I have a ton of these. Um, my, I've been doing my show going on, oh my gosh, I think two years now. So I have a year's, all of these are entanglements. All of these people up here. Holy cow. All entanglements. I have all their stories written on a sticky note, <clears throat> but come through. We have fun. People tell their stories. I retell them back for fun. So that's the fun part. Um, but yeah, come through. It, it's a good time. If anything comes, come Kiki in the comments, you know, they have a good time in the comments. You know, you've got to be probably one of the OG. Um, <laughs> um, I can say no, there. but then now as, as more shows get added, I'm like, Oh my gosh. Yeah. There was, there was not in nearly as many shows when I got added onto the shows, um, into the show thing. So my, I got my show in November, November, December of 2020. So prior to that, there was, there was probably maybe only like, they weren't doing shows on the weekend. So there was no weekend content and they were only doing shows Monday through Thursday. So there was nothing on a Friday other than the rundown. So you're talking maybe, I don't know, maybe 10 shows, maybe 10, 10 shows. Hi, Chrissy. So it was, there was like, you know, adding on it, um, you know, Chris, Chris wasn't too sure about this show um but he trusted me much, it's always popping in your stream oh my goodness whenever i jump in there i see in your in your show to be honest that map just oh my gosh it's, <laughs> it's literally entangled it is very much entangled um i think a lot of people may look at it and be like what but i know what my notes mean and we just talk through the story and i just really love telling people's story back so a lot of times people like to come in and just uh 
Some people will wait and come in later because they're just like, all right, I'm here for the recap. I just want to hear you <laughs> tell the story. Um, it just depends, you know, who comes in and tells their story and what. But you know, we all like to listen to mess, and it's always fun when you can listen to mess and be like, that's not mine. So you know, <laughs> you're like, or you it's come in. Else's. Yeah, you know, because I, I look at it two ways, right? People can come in and be like, hey, okay, my stuff's not that bad. Or it's also a way for people to just kind of tell a story that maybe you look back on and you can just laugh at, right? You're just like, oh my gosh, like back then this was really serious. But when I look back on it, hilarious. I can't believe I ever did something like that or I went through that or, um, you know, and some people in the comments, you know, you find it, but you got to have tough skin when you come in there because. Next time I go in, I'm going to be like, Jilly, <laughs> they do that when they come in there they start writing down when it gets it just depends you know and it's hit or miss i don't i don't typically know the stories before they come in so you're listening to them and i'm listening to them for the first time together so everything is very oh, wow. on the spot so like we learn together my reactions are very much how i'm feeling about it so you know <laughs> you gotta just go and and we just see where it goes we're on an adventure you know? not only that but julie hosts the most incredible battles the auctions i love to watch them <laughs> like, if you don't know she is make sure you go favor to make sure you go Thank go you. like create some thunder in there come hang out i love especially if you have content or i pause that anytime you push the live button it's content right everything is content right. but in, if you're wanting to like have special i like people who want to put together like curated content whether it's a show or whether it's an event like if you want to just come bounce ideas like i love talking about that kind of stuff i love helping people kind of figure out how to navigate that and format that um because it's fun you know we need stuff on here you want new fresh things and and there's room for everybody and all kinds of stuff in there so come hang out on a regular stream sometimes we're you know i get random there's that time you know sometimes it may be national something day and we're just celebrating it just because so well yeah come hang out i love doing that um i have my non-featured show sunday which is top badge squares it's my fun game show that we do every Sunday at six o'clock. Come through. You get to watch a, a a bunch of top badges. You know, make you know, talk a little, talk a little trash, and people get to play tic tac toe uh, with trivia. People get in the box, and if they lose, they do embarrassing stuff that they've agreed to do should they lose. So it's very entertaining. You get to come and, and you know, uh, we stay on top badge scores. We play for dignity. So there you go. Only one person leaves with their dignity intact. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I miss you a lot, a lot of, a lot of shows. But it's also a fun way to to meet. I did the show Top Badge Squares because I wanted to also give my uh, fellow Top Badge an opportunity to, you know, be it, when you're in someone else's stream, you can kind of let loose a little more, right? When you're not running a stream, you're just a guest. So it's a fun way for you to get exposed to maybe Top Badges you weren't familiar with and get to see their personality in, in other spaces than maybe in their stream where you don't catch them, but you get to see them, you know, talk trash to each other and. I don't know, maybe see how well you know if someone's lying or not. So you get to come in and, and have fun. So it's fun. Every Sunday we're back because we didn't do it over 4th of July. But this Sunday, 6 o'clock, come check it out. It'll be a fun time, I promise. Let's go. Thank you so much, Jelly. I appreciate Thanks you. for me. This was very unexpected. So thank you so much. You know, every time I have any of our other coffee creators stop by, I like to have them spam. So feel free to spam whenever you're in here. I appreciate um, that. Thank you. Yeah, for reals. Thank well, you so much, Jelly. Thanks. Bye, guys. Let me take care. Ladies and gentlemen, that wraps it up for the spotlight. Just like how we end it every week. Here it is. Let's go. Oops. Yo, what's up, everybody? Thank you so much for joining me this week on the spotlight, where we bring to you past, present, future artists, and showcase this, our very own Meet Me community. Make sure you hit that play button at the top and tune in every week, same time, same place. That was an awesome show. I loved it. It was super cool. Make sure you tune in same time, same place every week. Y'all got to stop by next week. We got, we got an amazing show lined up for next week, too. Great artists. Who would have thought that we would have literally opposite sides of the world? Yeah. You know what? You, you guys are awesome. Opposite sides of the world, showcasing your amazing talent. Congratulations. Thank you so much. You know what? I'm going to play around with these lights a little bit. Oh, I guess I can't. My brother decided to install these lights in here and check it out. Boom. What do you think? Should we keep them on for the show? Make it a party? Man, this that's really slow. This is really quick.
fast. Fancy, I know. But you know what it does? It, it messes with my eyes, and I feel like it. my eyes are like, I don't know, it's kind of intense. Need a slow fade. I know, I, 